Hi y'all, this is Joanne. Welcome back to my channel. If you haven't yet, I'd love for you to click and subscribe. Well, this is going to be a bit of a mixed bag today. I'm going to be talking about a few different things. But before I start, I just wanted to show you this. My grandniece was over yesterday and I was doing some paper collages and she wanted to do some too. She's four years old, so this is some of her work. I thought that was so cute. I think I have a young crafter in the future. Someone to share my passion, I hope. First up though is this is the um, bag that my bag of tags comes with. And I had a couple of requests to show how I make them. They're really pretty simple. I mean, there are other videos on it, but um, I thought I'd go ahead and show that. So first, I've been using these, I don't know if this will all go on screen, the last Whole Earth catalog pages from that. Pretty big. This one's a great bus race. It's got some pretty cool things in it, but... Um, I'm sorry, I just had a low battery notice. Um, anyway, first I just fold it to about the size I want. Like I said, it's pretty pretty basic. I'm sure most of you have done these. Actually, I need to fold that over a little bit more. There we go. that lined up and I'll be trimming as we go and well knocking things around here so how's everybody's weekend going I still don't have that straight goodness me hope everybody's having a fun weekend Get some crafting in some relaxing Glue this edge down. I love these big numbers that are on the pages. I'm just going to trim this up a little bit. And then to do the bottom edge of the bag, I just Fold that up. And like I said, it's nothing new or different. But I thought I'd go ahead and do this since I had a request for it. Clip the edges off. Hopefully stay in frame. And then trim this little edge off. Can I do that in frame? That off. Just run a little bit of glue down. Get this edge up there. I had a couple good thrift shop outings lately. I think I might do the next video on that. Haven't ever done a haul video yet. All right, now I'm just going to glue the two sides down here to make the little pocket on the front. Quick and easy to do. Now I'm going to get a two inch circle punch here. Just eyeball this like I usually do. Get the scrap out of the pocket would be good. So that's that. Now I'm just going to ink around it a little bit. I'm making all kind of noise here. And then, just going 
get some lace put on the pocket. y'all had any good thrift store finds lately? I'd love if you'd let me know in the comments what kind of goodies you've maybe found. Hope I was in frame. Okay, and that's, that's it. Really quick and easy. A little pocket here. I usually put one tag in here and then I have uh, three more larger tags that I put in the top and that's the bag for my bag of tags. Love this paper. So much cool stuff on it. Anyway that's that's that one. And next I wanted to show you these envelopes I've been making. One of my first videos, I did show these, but I've really been having a good time with these overlays. They're digital overlays, and they're um, from my daughter-in-law Mia's shop, which I've got linked below. They're just overlays that you put on any kind of paper, and you get different effects. So I've been using scrapbook paper for the background. Like, this is just the green scrapbook fabric. And this is the overlay. The inside I've done the overlay just to show you, you know, what the difference is in the different papers. And I love how they've been coming out. This is the back. I've stitched all around them. And these tags are from Nevermore Creation 17. I've also got her link below. Love these little cards. I've got some lace across here, but I just I'm having so much fun. This is one. This is a more plain scrapbook paper, and this is the overlay. And then you can see how it looks on just the back side, the plain white paper. Little collaging on the back. I've mostly just wanted you to see how these turn out with the different backgrounds. I think they're so cute. The envelopes are in my shop. I try to keep it stocked with these because I just really like them. I love this paper. But that's that. And since I seem to be into envelopes lately, I thought I'd go ahead and show you my latest ones, I've been, these are for an order that I've been working on. So I thought I'd go ahead and show you these real quick. They're pretty much like the ones I had shown last week. They're all just a little bit different. Just try to do some layering and different things on them. Really like doing the script stamping as the first layer. I enjoy making these. Do y'all do envelopes? I mean, I know a lot of people do, obviously. I'd love to hear about yours or see them. And here's this one. This is a longer envelope. So that's those. Well, that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please like and subscribe. Till next time, bye-bye.